father is angry, you know, actually, he's a nice person. So, phew, that was close. Uh, let's go to our Eclipse environment and call up the manifest file. And he said we could call um, the process without this Eclipse body. Instead, we can do what is called an extension. All right. So if the extension tab does not come up, just click on this. And now we're going to define our three processes. These two and import order process through by way of um, using the extension points from the base. Uh, we have to call up the uh, process. Here it is. Just double click on it and then right click and define a new process. Okay. Since our process has been defined, we will not take the gener generated one uh, but call up as this name is. So we have that here. All right? And uh, we have to give you an ID. That's how um, the class can be searched by the OHI bundle uh, exactly as you call it from your process window. So it's the same name. Export to queue, and you can give it the um, label here. Export to um, active MQ. All right. So we save that, and we add the others. Same way. Call the process uh, extension point interface, and right click, and also. Um, this is the import. Yeah, we have it here. And give it an ID. Will be org. Then pure process import Q to AD. Alright, import Q to AD and give it the label import from active MQ. Okay, uh, we add another one for this uh, import order. Oh, you can call it up this way too. Okay, that's nice. So, again, it's a process and we browse for um, import order. And uh, again, given an ID. And this is oct.compare.process.import order. Right? Import. It's actually a post order. Right? So save this, and now we are ready to run. Um, let's refresh this. You notice a plugin has been created, and um, it's what we just defined just now. Okay, uh, give it a last check, and everything is in order. You can now run the uh, client and test it. It should work. Um, that means the um, bundle class path will take what this uh, package has exposed by through its extensions. All right. So this is how OSGI work. Um, it's like a real machine or electrical um, wiring network where an appliance is um, called by another through extension point, just like a tripping plug that you have on your wall socket, rather than more hardwired stuff. So this makes things more pluggable, detachable, decoupled, and so forth. So this should work unless I define something wrong. So I'm calling up uh, queue order. Yes, it is working. Yeah, we went through. And let's test the last one. <clears throat> so basically, this, this uh, pr proved the point, and Hang Seng is right. And this is the beauty of OSGI. So, um, 
Thank you. Then that this will make the uh, last video I'm making uh, to prove that use extension point for process instead of uh, eclipse body. Thank you. Bye.